July is a quiet time on the University of Alberta campus, even more so now that COVID-19 has closed classrooms and moved them online. It's going to be a surreal, a surreal time this fall. Um, if I if I really, really, really didn't want to get my degree going, um, to be honest, I'd take the year off. Rob Raincock is a fourth year education student at the University of Alberta. Suffering from asthma, he's already cautious around COVID-19, but worries that as his courses move online and labs are shrunk or attendance not mandatory, he's not getting the best education. I don't think I would learn very much if I did a, a practicum as a teacher, you know, over, over a, a computer. You know, to my students, I, I, I would like to have students in the classroom. Raincock lives in Red Deer and has no plans to go on campus unless he needs to. He also wonders why he has to pay full tuition for a diminished university experience. At McEwen University, they're preparing for students to move in for the fall. The apartment-style residences usually house two to a room. They're now at half occupancy, with laundry facilities the only shared space. Wendy Brost with McEwen Residence Services says they're doing virtually everything possible to make sure students still have a university experience. These grade 12 graduates, I think they've already missed out on so much of that, you know, the rite of passage of missing their graduations and um, missing the end of their grade 12 year that now they're whole experience of moving to campus or going to university is different. In Edmonton, Darcy Ropchan, City News.